hey what's up everybody happy friday friday sews this is my friday sews at da, 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 da. kansas city fashion week yes your girl is here participating as a vendor this year not in the fashion show honestly just didn't want to be backstage with all of the business i just wanted a nice chill time where i could be here amongst all the other fashion um enthusiasts and just share my collection of upcycled garments with this group but for today i'm here representing you guys remember this upcycle this men's blazer upcycle that was inspired by the borrowed technique of adding patchwork on top of existing garments. So let's get into it. Wish me the best, Casey Fashion Week. everyone that was last Friday so I am back home now in my natural habitat feels good that was an enjoyable experience lots of good things happen and so I want to do a subscriber shout out but real quick before I do a subscriber shout out I am going to do a, y'all see, I'm still having trouble as to where to focus. Oh goodness, gotta love it. Um, I would like to do a channel shout out first. So this shout out is going out to a new channel that I discovered. Um, I, I really enjoy watching this channel. It's called Gemini Stitches. And, um, she shared her story of one on one of her videos. She shared her story of how she overcame a medical condition. And it was just a beautiful story and my heart was moved. And she is just a lovely personality. I love her makes. I just got through watching one of her videos where she made uh, some pumpkins from uh, uh, a pattern that she purchased off of Etsy. Beautiful pumpkins got me in the mood to make pumpkins now. <laughs> And, um, but yeah, um, she also started a hashtag, uh, called, uh, small sewing channel, hashtag small sewing channel, where she is open and allowing, uh, small content creators who have, I think 2000 or less subscribers to use that hashtag to help, um, just spread the word about all channels. So if you haven't subscribed to Gemini Stitches, be sure to go over there and subscribe to her lovely channel as well. Now, for my subscriber shout out, today's shout out is going to someone special. Someone who knows what this is. Someone who commented on my video that I uploaded recently where I shared my vintage patterns, my top 10 rare find vintage patterns. And I shared this. Um, I mentioned that I thought it was a pattern when I purchased it, 
but when I opened it, I realized that it is transfers for doing hand embroidery, iron-on transfers, so that you can do these really cool needle embroidery stitches. So yes, this is going out to Lady Nine Tails. Let me bring it down a notch. So I'm excited because Lady Nine Tails, you have, you've been with me for quite a while. I don't know how long, but your comments pop up almost on almost all my videos every single time. And when I read your comment where you said that you still do the hand embroidery, I was like, oh honey, this pattern has just been sitting in my stash. I'm not going to do anything with it. I would love for you to have it. If you're interested, comment below. Let me know. And I will reply to that comment with my email address so that I can just ship this to you. I would love for you to have it. If you want it, it's yours. You got it. Thank you. So, I have one more thing I wanted to share with you guys really, really quickly before I go. And I did do a... A video where I showed how to make how I make my uh, quilted corsets some of you may remember I think it was actually last fall this was still a pillowcase and I featured it on one of my Friday sews videos and I think I had said I was gonna make some shorts or a skirt out of it it may have been earlier this spring when I featured it but anyways this is it I made this lovely corset Oh my gosh, check the link in the description for these zippers that I purchased on Amazon. These uh, separating zippers with the uh, zipper teeth that has a contrasting color than the zipper tape. Uh, these are, I think, 10 inches, maybe 12, I can't remember. I'll put a link in the description if anyone's interested. They're perfect for these corsets. But yeah, this was a set of California King Size quilted pillowcases. I'll throw up some pictures of me wearing it out. Got so many compliments. <laughs> inside I it's fully lined and I mentioned in the video where I did a tutorial on how I make the pattern that I use to make this that this lace you all may recognize it comes from Hobby Lobby you know it goes on sale about every other week for 40% off <laughs> she's divine isn't she <laughs> But I just wanted to uh, include that in this, uh, today's video as well. As you guys can see, look, I got a lot to do. I am hosting a couples party. I've invited 10 couples to the house and I got some cleaning and rearranging of furniture to do. So your girl is in, you know, cleaning mode. Um, but yeah, thank you guys for tuning in and watching today. I love you madly. I'm just looking at my list to see if there's anything else I wanted to say. And there isn't. I got some house cleaning to do. Happy Friday to you. Peace and blessings. Mwah.